You're very welcome here to be out in the cottage in the west of Ireland. There's been some massive downpours of rain and lots of wind. It's been the stormiest and wettest winter solstice, but it's been beautiful. Just beautiful. A sheer delight to be outside, to go walking and just... Oh, capturing that energy. The energy is incredible at this time of the year. And of course, the dawn and the dusk are so close together. And these are very magical, liminal times. So it's wonderful just to get outside as the dawn is breaking or to go for that little walk as sunset comes down upon us. No wonder people throughout the ages have celebrated at this time of the year, at the solstice, because they know that the darkness, the dark nights, the dark that surrounds them is beginning to grow less. It's beginning to lessen and very soon after the solstice, after this wonderful festival of light, the light in the sky begins to rise, begins to return. And as you recall, in my last video, I told you all that I'm finally getting internet into the cottage. So this is wonderful. It's going to be happening next Thursday. It's quite expensive. It's going to be costing me 50 euros a month. But I think it's going to be a great advantage to me after all these years. I've been on I've been on social media on the internet now for over 11 or is it 12 years simply using the little hotspot on my phone. So I'm really looking forward now to 2024 and engaging more and more with you because it's going to be so quick and easy to upload a video. Do you remember when I was uploading videos that were taking five and six and seven hours? <laughs> Is that dedication or what? So over the next couple of days, you're going to be celebrating Christmas. And although my main celebration is the solstice, when my family comes together and we feast and we talk and we sing and we just gather together and have a lovely time, we extend that then into Christmas and we extend that beyond Christmas and into the new year. Because this time of the year, when we're surrounded by so much darkness, it's wonderful to come together and celebrate. And even if you're just celebrating on one's own, whether it's just making a special meal for yourself, lighting a candle, making a wish. Oh, and that's very important. We made our wishes over the fire. You do this every year. And... I think it allows us to focus on what others need and on those who have passed and just the love of family, friends, acquaintances. And it's why I've been making these little posters and putting them up about celebrating solstice because I think it's a wonderful, ancient celebration. And we should almost reculture ourselves with remembering and resurrecting the old, ancient celebrations. Don't forget, we are here because of our ancestors. And so, we look forward now to the first signs 
of Imok here in the west of Ireland. And for those of you who aren't familiar with the way the land comes back to life here in Ireland, we are about a month ahead of um, England in terms of the light and the 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 way that that impacts upon the earth. So the daffodils, the little green shoots of the daffodils are beginning to poke through already. And um, there's little buds beginning to form on quite a few of the trees and shrubs. So there'll be a lot more filming outside. And of course, I continue to work in the woodland. And there are a few exciting things I want to share with you over the next few weeks. So um, look out for those. And for those of you who support me on Patreon, a huge thank you. It's just amazing to be so regarded in this way. And I'm always amazed that, um, you know, people actually go on to Patreon and make that three euros a month donation and sometimes more. So I just want to say thank you so much. My books are on the website and um, I'll post a little link in the comments below to the website. And I just wish you all a very merry Christmas and a very merry Yule. Of course, Yule goes on for much longer than Christmas. And also, remember, at this time of year, as we come out of Christmas and we go towards the first day of January, (coughs) we have the Lord of Misrule. Yeah, it's very popular in Shakespeare's day. So that's something I'll be talking about in my next video. So blessings to you all, my friends. Have a wonderful Christmas. Have a wonderful, wonderful Christmas. Blessings to you all.